Hey everyone, we all know a limo or a limousine is a vehicle that's been stretched out to the max. They come in many different forms, but there are some limos much longer than the rest. So in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at 15 of the most unbelievably long limos in the world. Let's begin. Number 15. Midnight Rider All right, kicking off the list of unbelievably long limos is a Guinness World Record holder. Designed by the American duo Pamela Bartholomew and Michael Machado, the Midnight River isn't just one of the largest vehicles in the world, but it holds the record for being the world's heaviest limousine. This thing is an absolute beast, and both demands and commands respect as it rips down the highway, carrying its lucky passengers. It certainly is intimidating from the outside. It was built in 1986 as a luxury limo and weighs over 25 tons. It's nearly 70 feet long and runs on a whopping 22 wheels. The interior is just as impressive, though. It's made with high-quality fabrics, copper, wood, and mirrored surfaces with enough space to fit up to 40 passengers. Yeah, that's one big prom party. The Jet Black Midnight Rider features an 1800-watt sound system, a dance hall complete with a DJ booth, three separate lounge areas, and a large, fully equipped bar to help keep things toasted. Something like this is big enough to be a house, and maybe the right buyer can make that happen. Converting some of those lounges into bedrooms and adding a bathroom as well might not be too hard. But the Midnight Rider earns its name, not just because of its uber-cool look, but from the film of the same name. And it's not only one of the longest limousines in the world, but probably one of the coolest. Number 14. The DeLorean The film Back to the Future features some iconic lines and even more iconic characters. But one character managed to steal the show long after the credits rolled. The DeLorean. Every teenager wanted to ride around in this time-traveling car from the 1980s. And the thing about getting older means you start to earn money, which means all of the nerds from the 1980s were able to make their dreams a reality, which is exactly what Rich Weissenel did. Weissenel has multiple DeLoreans, each with its own unique modifications, but it's his limo that's captured the attention of so many enthusiasts. The six gullwing door DeLorean limo stretches the length of a school bus, with the interior still unfinished. He's brought it to multiple car shows, installing mod chips for visual purposes, but it seems that the interior will remain bare. This isn't your typical Vegas limo, used as a gimmick for sleazy bachelor and bachelorette parties. This limo uses parts from six different cars, and because only 9,000 DeLoreans were ever produced, Moisenol has to be incredibly meticulous when it comes to making adjustments and additions. He started his project in the year 2000 and spent at least 12 years making it into what it is today. Now, the tough part will be inventing the flux capacitor. Number 13. Pink Hummer H2 The Hummer H2 popped up on roads all across the United States during the early 2000s, and while it certainly ran and handled well, the extreme gas guzzler took up a little too much space and served more as a statement piece than a functional road vehicle. Nowadays, you don't see too many of these H2s parked outside, that is, unless you've called in the Pink Hummer H2 limo. This giant pink vehicle could be rented out by limo companies all over the country, most of which will tell you that it's a huge seller around prom and wedding season. And it's kind of not hard to see why. This limo is certainly aimed at women with its hot pink exterior. Anyone will be impressed once they step inside. Designed to be a party mobile, it's not uncommon for these stretched H2s to have a matching plush pink interior complete with a disco ball and pink laser light show, and a fun, wavy bubblegum pop aesthetic, as opposed to the cold grays and blacks of your typical limo. But just how big are these stretched out H2s? Well, seeing as how they're already bringing the party, expect them to have more than enough space for at least 20 passengers. Number 12. Mammoth F650 the Ford F650 Super Truck is already huge, and it's basically used in commercial towing and industrial use. It's not the type of vehicle you associate with luxury or park in your driveway. If anything, if you see one on the street, it's probably covered in dirt or dust and has a ladder and construction tools hanging out of the bed. But that didn't stop someone from turning the truck up to 11 and creating the Mammoth F650. This limo is a perfect blend of ominous and awesome, and it's incredibly intimidating to see it roaring down the highway. And while it is a behemoth in its own right, it's still incredibly luxurious inside. The limo is usually equipped with hardwood floors, flat-screen TVs, LEDs, sound systems, and if you're lucky, a full bar. 
You can even find a stripper pole in some of the models. And while the manufacturer keeps the exact length and weight of the giant limo hush-hush, we know that they can all accommodate up to 30 passengers at a time and still leave some space for elbow room. That means that the Mammoth F650 is about as large as a bus. Number 11. KAZ Electric Limo The KAZ, which stands for Kio Advanced Zero Emission Vehicle, was designed in Japan. It's been built to handle like a sports car with a top speed of about 185 miles an hour and has 600 horsepower, which is pretty impressive for a vehicle of this size. And while it's not as long as your average stretch limo, the KAZ has eight wheels, and it's designed for stability and balance as it hits those top speeds while carrying VIPs. The impressive futuristic limo is also running on lithium-ion battery technology, using a total of 84 to start it up, and the battery capacity provides a full ride for 180 miles before recharging. This magnificent battery makes the KAZ limo one of the longest-lasting cars in its class, and easy on the environment, too. With its extraordinary exterior and impressive engine capacity, the KAZ is certainly one of the coolest limos ever made. It is living proof that electric cars can be just as fast while maintaining a unique and sleek interior, as well as the exterior, too. The fact that it's electric may not be everyone's cup of tea appearance-wise, but you have to admit it's pretty impressive what they achieved with it. And who knows, maybe it's the future of limousines. Number 10. Learjet Limo when Ric Flair proclaimed himself as the stylin', profilin', limousine-drivin', jet-flyin', kiss-stealin', wheelin' and dealin' son of a gun, he was probably talking about this entry on our list. First introduced as a prototype in 2006, this Learjet limo is in full service and ready for hire, and despite what you may think, it's 100% street legal. This extraordinary creation is a converted Mercedes bus that can accommodate up to 30 people. It's simply a Learjet without wings and a tail, and it's about 53 feet long. How anyone was able to pull this off is anybody's guess, but the idea here was to create a luxurious transportation and to find an alternative for aircraft that could no longer be used for flying. This road-legal limo can reach a top speed of 24 miles an hour, thanks to its original turbo-diesel engine that weighs 24,000 pounds when fully fueled. A steering wheel was added, and while most of the cockpit stayed the same, the limo extravagance reflects in a fog machine, strobe lights, mirrors in the ceiling, aerodynamic seats, and a small bathroom. It's even got the option for a sleepover, too. It was sold for $275,000 and now is part of Limo Bob, aka The Legend, the owner of the Star Limo Service. And so now, when you're in LA, you can rent a limo for a hundred grand a month, or you could even buy it for a million bucks. So in the end, maybe you really do have to be Ric Flair to go for a ride in this thing. Woo! Number 9. Ultra Custom Coach The Ultra Custom Coach is an absurd monster of a limousine that's so long that it took combining two vehicles to make. Custom built by California's Ultra Custom Coach for the United Arab Emirates Sheikh Hamad bin Hamdan Al Nayan. This limo is over 66 feet long, and it's officially 18 inches too long to be street legal. So the good Sheikh just had another shop chop off those extra inches. But to put that into perspective, an average city bus is about 40 feet. This limo can seat up to 36 people, has 15 windows on each side, and the limo's even hinged in the middle so it can go around corners. The Sheik paid about $1.8 million for the Ultra Stretch limo, which is just a drop in the bucket for this guy. It contains TV sets, built-in phones, love seats, a microwave, and two fax machines. But because it's so big, don't expect to see it anywhere outside the Sheik's massive garage where he keeps the rest of his massive cars. Number 8. The Monster What happens when you need a limo for Sunday, Sunday, Sunday? Then you get the Monster Limo. The Monster Limo was created by SDN Industries and certainly has the wow factor as it drives through your neighborhood, crushing everything in its path. This Monster Limo is wrapped in stickers, typically flames, and can be easily removed and new ones added depending on the event. But it's mostly purposed for events such as campaigns in busy urban streets, grand openings, car shows, NASCAR races of course, and even colleges and auto shows. The Monster Limo is a great advertising tool, as it's bound to capture the attention of passers-by, which is probably the point. This is the type of limo that's more of a statement piece than it is a party bus. But even so, it could be a great way to go off-roading in between parties. Number 7. Dodge Viper Limo Convertible 
All right, it should be pretty clear by now that there are a number of crazy creations in the ever eccentric world of limousines, and this Dodge Viper is certainly one of the more extreme conversions you'll ever come across. The car was recently listed up for sale on eBay in 2021, and while it failed to sell, it's still worth talking about, considering just how bizarre it is. Apparently, this is the only Dodge Viper in the world that's been converted into a limousine, and as a perfectly good Viper had to be ruined to create it, I'd certainly hope there aren't any others like this. Those who built this thing managed to keep the front end of the Viper intact, so much so that if you cover up the rest of the car, you could be excused for thinking it was just like any other Viper. However, once you cast your eyes beyond the crash bar behind the two front seats, that's where things start to get interesting. There's a massive passenger compartment that can apparently accommodate 12 passengers, and unlike most other limousines, this one is a convertible. Like the front end, the rear of the limousine is just like a normal Viper. Few details about the car were provided in the eBay listing, other than the fact that it retains its standard 8-liter naturally aspirated V10 engine, and that it's been used for numerous TV shows, commercials, and events. The limo is advertised as 25 feet long, and was listed with a minimum starting price of 135 grand. Number 6. The Bat Limmobile Another one of the most iconic cars belongs to one of the most iconic characters, the Batman. And while we all have our favorite Batmobile, Tim Burton's version is favored by many children of the 1980s. This amazing recreation of the most recognized car in the world is a limousine that can seat up to 12 people. The Batmobile limo isn't just a pretty face either, it's got some serious performance under that hood. It's got a V8 Corvette engine that puts out over a thousand horsepower that lets it go from zero to 60 in just three and a half seconds. It's no wonder this project cost over four million dollars. Inspired by the Tim Burton Batman movies released in 1989 and 1992, the Batmobile limousine was created by a team of engineers and car enthusiasts who wanted to build the ultimate recreation of the famous car. The project took over two years to complete, and the result is an amazing piece of machinery that's sure to turn heads wherever it goes. This Batmobile limo is also equipped with air conditioning, a sound system, and a TV monitor for those long road trips. And as you'd expect, the vehicle is one of a kind, and unfortunately, not for sale. Number 5. Ferrari 360 Limo the Ferrari 360 Modena limousine, with the term used generically since there are a handful of examples around the world, boasts several Guinness World Records, including that of being the world's longest Ferrari and the world's fastest limousine. Builders from the UK, Australia, and the United States have been tempted to make them time and time again, and the conversion is almost always done in the same way. Cut the Ferrari in half and extend the middle, and then pack the interior with everything you'd find in a Vegas limousine. Screens, disco lights, smoke machines, wet bars, and a premium sound system. Naturally, the more stuff they put inside, the more weight that they add, and the slower the Ferrari becomes. But that doesn't mean it isn't awesome. This long red rocket comes in Rosso Corsa, with aftermarket 19-inch wheels, and they typically come with a 3.6-liter engine that really never disappoints. Performance-wise, this will get the limo from 0 to 60 in under 6 seconds. Yeah, that's not bad for a limo. Number 4. The Super Bus The idea for the Super Bus was originally conceived by a Dutch astronaut and physicist, Dr. Wobbo Ockels, while traveling between two cities in Europe. His side became the Superbus, a 23-seater slimline aerodynamic transport system. The plan was to create special lanes in cities so that the bus could travel intercity without disruption at speeds of up to 155 miles an hour via electric power. In Europe and other northern hemisphere countries, there was an idea to have a geothermal system laid into these special lanes to keep them from icing up, but so far these are all just hopes and dreams. The Superbus was originally financed by the Dutch government with a local transport company, and also providing some much-needed cash, Dow Chemicals even injected some money into the project, and the Saudi company Sabic helped with some other smaller partners for specific components. This is definitely some future tech, and the technology that underpins the Superbus is mostly carbon. An ex-Ferrari and Williams F1 aerodynamicist Antonia Terzi designed the super sleek body with eight gullwing doors. The body and chassis are made of carbon fiber, the brakes are carbon ceramic, and the wheels are carbon magnesium for lightness. The overall weight of the vehicle is just 10 tons fully loaded, despite the materials used, and it's got a 49-foot length. From reports, the Superbus also has six-wheel steering to help with the sheer size of the vehicle. The power output's rated at 400 kilowatts, and the energy source are lithium polymer batteries with a regenerative braking system. 
The vehicle can be driven by a human, however, once it's on a special lane, the autopilot takes over so everyone can just sit back, relax, and enjoy the ride. The original plan was to have the Superbus running by 2016 with hundreds of them in use by 2026, but this was disrupted by the untimely death of one of the project's leaders in 2014. Number 3. Snake Liner President Suite The President's Suite measures a stunning 59 feet long and 8 feet wide, not including the driver's cabin. But if that wasn't big enough, both sides can be extended outward a further 4 feet to make it just over 16 feet wide when fully set up. And it isn't just the size that makes this mobile behemoth feel like a house. Interior fittings such as the granite dining room table give a feel that isn't all lightweight and motor homey. Other lavish interiors features a big screen in every room, a king-sized waterbed, a washing machine, a dryer, satellite internet, a central heating system, soundproofing, a remote control door, and a fire extinguishing system. It has to be not just one of the coolest, but one of the only stretched limo caravans in the world. But the fun isn't left to the exteriors. On the outside, the President's Suite boasts electric window shades, a steel-reinforced door, thermoglass, and of course, a water and sewage tank. However, if you're still thirsty for more, you can request optional add-ons, such as an additional story, granite floors, a garage for a vehicle, a cellar for a motorboat, and a helicopter pad. Although the nominal price for the President's Suite starts at about 920 grand, the high levels of customization the Snake Liner offers means that the price could vary by hundreds of thousands of dollars. So seeing as how one can easily spend over a million bucks on this thing, it's not exactly the right fit for the budget traveler, although it could take van life to new extremes. Number 2. The Boeing Limo this insane limo consists of various components from both a Boeing 727 and a Mercedes-Benz bus. The limo's body consists of the shell of a 727 that has had its wings and tail clipped off. Despite what it's become, the original staircase that folds in and out of the plane is still fully intact and usable. The chassis, steering, and gas tank are all sourced from the Mercedes bus. This odd Boeing limo was created in Guadalajara, Mexico, and has since made its way into the United States. Unfortunately, no one knows for sure who is responsible for the design, but whoever they are, they're geniuses. But the company Vaca Limousines is responsible for blessing the world with this glorious invention. Apparently, they are the most successful limo rental and design company in all of Mexico. Therefore, it's likely they knew exactly what they were doing when designing this thing. This strange stretch is owned and operated by the late Robert J. Strausser, aka Limo Bob's LA-based company Star Limo Service. Apparently, Strauser purchased the limo from Vaca for around 275 grand and held on to it till his death in 2020. Today, the bus slash plane thing is on sale once again. However, this time for an eye-watering million bucks. If you don't have that kind of cash, don't worry, because you can go to LA and rent the gargantuan vehicle for a small sum of $100,000 a month. Number 1. The American Dream What is the American Dream? Well, in this case, it's the world's longest limo. At 100 feet and 1.5 and inches long, don't expect to see Challengers anytime soon. But as impressive as this helipad-equipped massive Cadillac is, what's even more impressive is that its restoration was completed at all. This limo was in terrible shape, left to rot until the end of time in New York. Multiple people had attempted to restore this long limo to its former glory, but all of them had failed tremendously until Michael Deezer, a prominent real estate developer in New York and Florida, and Michael Manning of Autoseum worked together to make it happen. Along the way, three Cadillacs were cannibalized until an untold amount of rust was removed. Yards of leather and vinyl carpet were employed, and the engines were replaced. The subframe looks more like a bridge truss than anything you'd find in a vehicle. In fact, Manning admits rebuilding it was more of a civil engineering project than an automotive restoration. Clearly, the two had their work cut out for them. Six Eldorados were conjoined during the original construction of this 24-wheeled Cadillac, conceived by Jay Orberg, the same guy who designed Kit from Knight Rider and the DeLorean from Back to the Future. The American Dream's tail housed a helipad, whose surface could be used as a putting green whenever the chopper wasn't around. In its original iteration, it also had two engines, dozens of windows, TVs, telephones, a lounge, a waterbed, a jacuzzi, and a swimming pool with a diving board. The American Dream is still alive and well, although it may not be what it once was. It's fully functional, as best as something like this can be, and while it can't hit any turns, there's enough room for 75 people inside to go absolutely crazy which is really all that matters. We'll see you tomorrow.
Watch our Vehicles playlist for more top 15 videos about amazing vehicles. Sit back, relax, and binge watch all of our best vehicle videos.